back to another video. Well, yeah, I'm using my laptop, so the audio is gonna be but, but, uh, so, I'm gonna do this real quick. So, um, I'm gonna be showing you how to do the dial up and then rotate. Yeah, it looks a little but, oh well, get over it. Okay, let's see, let's see. Um, here was the original watch from the last video on how to weld it, but we just added more parts. So I can show you if you have like a lot of parts on your watch, I'll show you how to do this. So go ahead and move this. Now watch. I cleaned it up, has no welds, so delete all your welds inside the watch. So it's just parts. Now select every all the band pieces. Okay, see these, these are all the bands. Control G group it. And we'll name this the band or the strap or whatever. And now for the dial pieces. Group that up for dial. Now we want the rotate pieces, which are the balls. And if you had another cylinder, we'll do this test one real quick. There we go, so go ahead and group these up and name these rotate because this part right here will rotate. Okay, and then we'll have to dial. Or just core, name this core. Okay, so we should have our parts. So now we got our only tricks. We have our band, our dial, and our arm. All we do, we'll go ahead and get our plugin. If you don't have this plugin, it's in the last video. So go ahead and download it. Go ahead and put that together. And then touch this part, and then our arm, our primary part, we're going to hold that together. If you had to slow down the video, slow it down. Okay, now um, our dial. Click core, primary, and now instead we'll click motor 6D. Create this. This is going to be a rig. And this, go and weld all these parts together. Okay, so this is welded up. And then we click this. And this, always, okay, rig to rotate to the core. So it picks it up with it, okay. Sorry if I'm going fast. If y'all need a more in-depth video, I can slowly do like a 20-30 minute video on this. I'm just trying to hurry and make it quick so I can go back and work on my game. Okay, so now we have our... Let's name these. This will be a uh, pop-up. It's like a uh, dial. And then rotate. Now we can click run, nothing should fall off the watch. If something falls off the watch, we got a problem. Okay, our watch fell, but it's okay. We gotta we gotta uh hold alt and click our watch, our primary part, and anchor it. Now nothing should fall off. We should have it rigged correctly, okay. Now we do get in the script. We wanna source our rigs or our Motor 60, so we'll cool. rotate. First, it's going to get tune service real quick. We'll call TS equal game, get service, tune service, okay. Now rotate, so it's fine. I'll rotate. It is Omnitrix. No, it's a script up parent dot dial dot rotate. Dot dial dot rotate. Yeah, it's weird, but that's what we gotta do. Script dot parent dot dial dot rotate. And it might be different for you guys because uh, your watch is gonna be different. But if you want to see how you do it, you script dot parent. So here, I'll make it easier for you. 
Well, I'll make two breaks. Equal to script parent. Omnitrix, so we'll go Omnitrix dot dial. Omnitrix dot dial dot rotate. And then just find your rotate rate. And it's right here. So Omnitrix dot dial dot rotate dot dial dot rotate. So sorry that's confusing, guys, but. Oh, you know what? You know what? If, you, if that's too confusing for you, take your rig. You put it in your Omnitrix. It's still rigged up, guys. We'll just put it in the Omnitrix and look at that. Our rigs are right here. So, so if you just go inside your parts, drag it out into the Omnitrix. Drag it out to the Omnitrix. It'll be right here. And it's still rigged right, right there to our parts. So don't worry about that. So we'll do Omnitrix.rotate. Way easier. Sorry for the confusion, guys. But if that's how you have to do it, and do it like that. And then pop up. Or dial core. What did I name it? It's not dial. It's dial and rotate kind of the same thing, but it's core, but it don't matter. It does matter to me. <laughs> okay, now uh, we'll do a wow tree. Do wait. One second, okay. Local pop up SQL TS, which is our tween service. Create eight, and then we'll uh, we'll do the core tween info local. Pop up time is equal to one. Change anything you want. This is just how fast the watch will dial up or pop up. If you want to add more stuff like the watch bouncing up or stuff like that, just do this and you'll do and um dot using. Easing style, okay, it's all right here. So, and then the easing style dot when errors are smoothest, back you just read them and they'll tell you. So, you can choose one of them, but blah blah blah. Whenever I do that, we're just gonna stick with the default linear. All right, I'm pretty sure it already comes with linear. Oh, linear, linear, no, no matter, okay. Uh, make a table, it's hold shift and these word bracket things are here. And it'll be um, core. No, 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 no. It'll be C zero equal core dot C zero times C frame dot new do zero point two as zero zero. Let's see if it works. Um, pop up play do twenty four dot new or you'll have this big confusion it's a bit messing up you don't know what the problem is i I've done it multiple times I still I still do it but just twenty four dot new pop up dot completed wait okay let's see. It should pop up for us. Yes. There we go, guys. Okay, now we're going to do um, local pop position is equal to Sorry, it's in the dark. Okay. Okay. Uh, core. Dot C O. No, you name this whatever you want. Just make sure the code's right. Pop down. Or be equal to. Pop. 
top position. And what's wrong with it? Oh, table broke. Okay. Hmm. Huh. What did I do? Oh. Sorry, guys. Okay, and then just copy this right here. And then pop down for these two. So now it'll play the pop up. It will wait till pop up's done. It will play the pop down. Wait till pop down's done, and re go through the cycle. So it'll be up, down, up, down, up, down. Wait one second. Up, down. Wait one second. Up, down. And now for the rotate. It is. Uh, Okay, we already sourced it out. Uh, rotate, dial, whatever else you want to call it, does not matter. C frame dot angles. Okay, and then, uh, Right here, we'll do math dot red negative 90 or 90, does not matter, or not even 90 is whatever number you want. Now, maybe it rotates the correct way. Uh, we didn't even play it yet. Hold up. Now, we'll just put these between here. So, rotate, play, rotate dot completed. Now I can space this out so y'all can not get confused. So we'll have pop up, rotate, and pop down. Oh. Huh. Okay. Let me look at this one real quick. Maybe it's the position. I'm sure I won't go. I think I know what it is. Okay, so I'm going to reweld it. Go ahead. We'll delete the rotate. Go dial. What part is on this one? I didn't. The core. Uh, okay, dial. Core. I'm going to try to reweld it. Take out. Rotate. Maybe now. What the freak, man? Oh, shit. There you go. Let's make sure it's correct, guys. And there you go. Got a pop up and a rotate. Only tricks. No, oh, my game's lagging. Okay. Uh, you can animate this, but uh, I found that <sighs> why animate when you could just do this. I mean, you still have to animate like your arm moving. Blah blah blah. Okay. Um. Now this is just just example code. Uh.
obviously, if you want this to be on your watch, uh, well, it will be, okay. I mean, it still is on my watch. You just had to put it in your code, like, press, when you press X, blah, 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 and you can just do play and then complete and whatnot. I'm still, okay, I'm going to show you all how to incorporate this in the next video. When we do transformations, I'll show you all how to do, like, the press X and press E, and then it'll, the watch will dial up, and when you press it, it will transform, obviously. But this is just for other people who want to do more than just a watch on, on how to rig and how to tween their uh, character accessories. But I think if we put this in here, it should work. And then that should be the end of the video. Just a quick little how to rig the watches, how to dial, and how to rotate them and whatnot. Yep, there we go. Thanks for watching. If y'all want to see transformation, just um, comment, like the video, and tell me what, what other tutorials you want to see. Bye bye.